Zapatitos are loading. Hey guys, Dodging here, and welcome to the potato episode. Okay, so it's not the poisonous potato episode, but I, I just, you know, Minecraft was doing their thing, so I thought it'd be funny if I had a bunch of poisonous potatoes, and anyway, so today we will be working on the church, the cemetery, and the blacksmith, which is going to be over here by this lovely lava pool that I almost destroyed. Oops. Anyway, um, so the blacksmith is going to go here. We're going to have, like, the main shop area is going to be this one. And then the blacksmith will live back here. And then this will be his little, like, tower. And then over here is going to be a crane picking up lava. That will be a really interesting build. I started gathering stuff for that. I got quite a bit of things in there. I got some stuff over here for the church. Yeah, not a lot of stuff for the church. I have to do some mining for that. But over here, I have planned out the next few builds. I have the lumber camp going over here. I already put a pile of lumber. And over here, this is going to be the town storage building. Notice how big it is. And I'm going to have this circle is going to be a nuclear power plant funnel. So later on in the episodes, when I finally take out the dragon and get wings, I can fly over top of this. And be like, oh, hey, I got a stack of stuff. Toss it in there. And it funnels down to the center. I have this all... Oh, let me go get my chest. I need that. This will funnel down to the center. And going forward, it will feed back into the warehouse. So... That's going to be a very big project. It'll probably... I'll, I'll probably just get it to go, like, up. Like, a water stream across, over to the warehouse, and then up to the top. And 8,000 million hoppers feeding it down into the storage system. The one storage system that I normally use still works. So that is the one we will be using. As far as the church and the blacksmith, I'm thinking more like, they're gonna be medieval-ish and match kind of the style of my house. So a little bit weird, but I've got some stuff in here and I'm gonna get started on that. However, in the world. I'll still have the wizard tower that I talked about before. Um, I have named the fishing village. Okay, over here at the fishing village. My dolphin has safely returned back to the ocean. So he didn't die or get stuck over here. I locked, not you. Yep, yep, I locked this guy, so he is definitely a fisherman. Oh, uh, he hello. Um, I guess a couple of villagers got busy. Anyhow, I just wanted to make sure these guys were doing good, and I gotta pick up some supplies. Just dirt. Okay, well, anyways. All right, guys, this is now a hard hat area. Let's get build.
Okay, guys. That short time lapses, those short time lapses, completes the blacksmith, the signal tower, and the vagabond camp. Which, the fake tree was like a last minute thing, but this is like for the hobos to hang out. Oh, and then I have, I, I, you saw the tunnel. The tunnel goes over to the signal tower. And they can go up inside the signal tower. Now, I just got finished collecting some cobble deep slate. And we're going to get started on the church. I still need a few more items. I want to get some... I'd like to get quartz. I really don't want to use diorite for that. And I'm going to need some regular stone. More than what I have. So I'm going to have to do some more mining. <sighs> okay. More resources. Here we go. Guys, look at this church. This is really cool. I really do like the way it turned out. I was I was hoping for more of like um a steeple somewhere, but I like the longhouse style church. It goes a little close to my tower, but that's okay. That's that'll be okay. It's kind of a medieval-ish kind of church. I just, I like the way it came out. On with the cemetery.
there. That finishes off the little cemetery here. I like my little mausoleum. I have a plan for that later. I found some mud. I'm going to add some mud here and there inside. And then the cemetery will be complete. Ooh, candles. Ooh, I should get candles. Oh, I don't have candles. Well, when I get candles, then we'll be able to add them to the cemetery. That'll look really cool. Now, let me show you inside the church here. Simple little church. I might actually sink that part. Will it be... Yeah, it should be fine. I could, uh, I could lower the arch a little bit. And then the church, the uh, cross will be right above it. Got some nice mahogany benches here. Pretty, pretty. And nothing in the book. Not yet. I'm going to add some stuff to the book later. And that finishes off the church. The church, the cemetery, the blacksmith, the camp. Ah. <sighs> Coming together. Over here, I marked out this is going to be the fountain coming into kind of the town center. Uh, oh no, the grass is taking over. I'll have to fix that. I'll dig up the uh, horse dirt and fix that pathway over there. So the this is kind of the town center. It's the main pathway, and then this one up here is like, this is the center of the industrial pathway because of my warehouse. So the next big project is going to be the warehouse. However, right now, I'm going to be planning the design for the town hall and lumber camp, and then a few other things in over by the blacksmith and cemetery actually i might leave i'll put a few trees next to the cemetery and then that'll be it over there so if you have any ideas for what this building should be should look like let me know in the comments down below over here is going to be the lumber camp i'm going to build a small little lumber mill just like the one from uh, Riverwood. It'll look almost exactly like it. It'll have a ramp that goes up, so a couple steps going up, and then the big sawmill going in here. The only thing is a lumber mill usually has a water wheel, so I might have to put in water. I don't want to. It's going to be a pain in the butt, but I might have to put in a river. So I have right here the lumber mill. I chose this spot because it's by a tree and there's a dip down here. So if I have the river just kind of like flow down the hill, so to speak, into this little dip, I'll just fill this up with water and that'll be okay. Ooh, I could have a ooh. All right, I'll save that idea for later. You guys will you guys will have to see how it turns out but it'll be this whole process when we do the lumber camp hmm well unless they move it up a block i might uh yeah I'll, i think i'll move it up a block oh yeah i like that a lot better well that ends the video for today so, I will see you guys next time. Bye!